Hi guys, this video will show you how to set up FXGL in Eclipse. And if you're using IntelliJ ID, um, then there is another video available in the description, which you can um, click through and then um, follow the tutorial there. Um, that video will also contain um, a tutorial on how to make a very simple game once you um, set up FXGL. So once you complete um, this video, I recommend that you go there and see how to make a very small game. Right, so um, with Eclipse open, um, the first thing you need to do is to install Maven plugin um, from this website. Um, I'll put up the link, but um, once you go there, you'll just need to copy um, this installation link. Go to Eclipse, help, and install new software. Once you place, once you paste the link there, should be able to um, install Maven integration for Eclipse. Or if you already have one, then you don't need to do anything. Uh, once you're done with that, it'll probably ask you to restart um, Eclipse. And um, once ready, you can click File, New, and then um, Other. Select Maven and Maven Project. Click on Create Simple Project and click Next. Group ID is going to be your reverse domain name. Um, I'll just put com.username. Artifact ID is the name of the game. I'm going to call it FXGL or my FXGL game. Obviously, this could be um, or this should be the name of the game that you're developing. Um, finish. It should generate a project called my FXGL game. And if you open pom.xml, which is the project object model for Maven, it will look like um, this. So what you need to do now is create um, repositories. And then if you go to FXGL repo on GitHub, um, scroll down to Maven, then copy repository uh, and then place it here. Next thing you'll need to do is to create dependencies or a single dependency for FXGL, which is the other bit. So just copy and paste that into uh, between those tags, which will essentially um, Download FXGL and it's all uh, all its dependencies. So if you do Control Shift F just to see it a bit more clear, and then once you save that file, it should ideally download um, FXGL. So it'll probably take a few moments. You should be able to see download bar right here in the um, bottom right corner. If it downloaded correctly, um, when you go to Maven dependencies, the first thing it should say FXGL 0.2.1, which is, by the way, the latest version currently. So as the new versions um, get released, this number will simply be replaced by the newer version. Apart from that, the rest should be more or less the same. Right, next thing is to create your package for your game, uh, which is going to be under source main Java. So package uh, my game. Then in that package, create new class, which is going to be your main class, my FXGL app. Uh, super class is going to be game application and select public static void main. When you click finish, it will generate um, your main class. If it says arg here, meaning they couldn't find javadoc, just control left click on game settings and it will, um, Maven will automatically download sources so and the javadoc as well. So you could um, query various method uh, properties and documentation within your ID. In the main method, uh, simply type launch and pass in arguments. Um, I typically like to have settings um, at the top, so I'm just going to copy and paste it there. Remove that bit, um, settings, set title, 
uh, my fxgl app and that should be enough um, if you do if you do right click run as java application hopefully you will see something like this which is the intro for fxgl and then you'll be prompted to um, by the menu to enter your profile so new profile just type profile test or something okay and then um, you should be able to um, do fxgl development um, so the title goes here um, as you can see um, everything else seems to be working correctly so this is how you set it up um, in eclipse and once you're uh, once you complete this video, um, I'd recommend going to um, the video, another video in the description, which will show you how to create a very simple game um, in FXGL. It is IntelliJ IDE, but um, the steps are identical, meaning the code is identical, so you don't need to do anything else. You might want to skip the uh, first several minutes of it where the setup is um, explained how um, in effect, in um, IntelliJ. Also, I noticed that it uses, for, uh, for some reason, Java 1.5. So if you want to um, go to properties and update that to Java 1.8, um, Java 1.8 standard, um, so that you don't run into any issues. You should be able to do this by um, right-click on the project, properties, Java build path, um, select system library, edit, and then just click um, workspace default JRE finish. That should uh, point that to the JRE runtime, which should be 1.8 um, in your case. And that is it uh, for this video of setting up FXGL and Eclipse. Thanks for watching.